केंद्रीय विद्यालय तकोलम की तरफ से मैं सभी को खेल दिवस की हार्दिक बधाई देता हूं और सभी का स्वागत करता हूं। खेल हमारे जीवन का परस, का अभिन्न अंग होता है हमें परस्पर खेल से जुड़ाव रखना चाहिए क्योंकि अगर हम खेलते रहेंगे तो हमेशा ही हम स्वस्थ रहेंगे खेल से हमारा आत्मविश्वास बढ़ता है और हमें अकादमिक रूप से उत्कृष्टता में उत्कृष्ट होने में सहायता मिलती है क्योंकि स्वस्थ शरीर में ही स्वस्थ मस्तिष्क का विकास होता है और मुझे यह बताने में अत्यंत प्रसन्नता हो रही है कि हमारे विद्यालय के छात्रों ने उत्कृष्ट खेल का प्रदर्शन किया है और हमारे विद्यालय को राष्ट्रीय लेवल पर प्रेजेंट किया है और हमारे विद्यालय में जो बच्चे हैं जो खेल से जुड़े हुए हैं हम उसको हम उनको बराबर प्रोत्साहित करने का भी काम करते हैं और हम हमेशा उन्हें प्रोत्साहित करते रहेंगे और अब मैं आप लोगों के बीच में आमंत्रित करना चाहूँगा मिस्टर सागर कनौजिया को जिन्होंने योगा में भारत को प्रजेंट किया है और भारत देश का मान हमेशा ही बढ़ा बढ़ाया है मिस्टर सागर कनौजिया धन्यवाद जी नमस्कार मैं सागर कनौजिया अंतर्राष्ट्रीय योग प्लेयर मैं करीबन चार साल से योग में हूँ और बहुत से स्टेट नेशनल इंटरनेशनल में मैंने अपने इंडिया को प्रेजेंट करते हुए पदक भी दिलाया मैं के वी के बच्चों को ये सूचना देना चाहता हूँ कि अब योग योग ही नहीं रह गया ये स्पोर्ट्स में भी आता है पहले लोग स्वास्थ्य के प्रति योग करते थे लेकिन अब योग योग ही नहीं रह गया अब सिर्फ योगा स्पोर्ट्स में आ सका है जिसके जरिए हम स्टेट डिस्ट्रिक्ट नेशनल इंटरनेशनल तक के जाके अपने भारत देश को प्रेजेंट कर सकते हैं और अपना पदक भी ला सकते हैं जिससे हम अपना मान सम्मान अपने परिवार का मान सम्मान अपने स्कूल का मान सम्मान तथा अपने गली मोहल्ले का मान सम्मान देश का मान सम्मान बढ़ाकर अपना नाम रोशन कर सकते हैं जिसके जरिए और सभी बच्चे प्रेरित हो सके मैं करीबन पाँच साल से चार पाँच साल से करीब योग से हूँ और मैंने स्वास्थ्य के प्रति योग शुरू किया था धीरे धीरे मैंने स्टेट डिस्ट्रिक्ट नेशनल में पदक भी लाया मेरा नेशनल में चार पदक थे स्टेट में पाँच पदक थे और डिस्ट्रिक्ट में छः पदक थे और जिसके जरिए मैंने नेशनल में सेलेक्ट होकर इंदौर में होने वाले नेशनल में सेलेक्ट होकर मैंने थाईलैंड के लिए सेलेक्ट हुआ और करीबन नवंबर 2019 में मैंने थाईलैंड पे गया कंपटीशन भी अटेंड किया और मैंने भारत देश को सेकंड पदक से प्रेरित किया जिससे हमें देखकर और सब बच्चे भी मोटिवेट होते हैं जागरूक होते हैं हमारे बनारस से तीन बच्चे करीब गए थे इंटरनेशनल में सेलेक्ट हुए थे इंटरनेशनल के लिए जिससे हमारा सेकंड पदक लगा हमारे साथ बाकी दो लड़कियां गए थे एक का पदक किसी भी कारण ना लग सका और दूसरे का पदक गोल्ड रहता इससे ये हम आपको सूचित कर रहे हैं कि आप भी प्रेरित हो अधिक से अधिक कंपटीशन अटेंड करें योग को समझे जाने क्या है क्या नहीं उससे प्रेरणा लें और योग में कुछ अच्छा करें आगे बढ़े धन्यवाद all my all my colleagues uh, today we are celebrating national sports day as we all know that the national sports day is celebrated every year on 29th of august and this particular day has been selected just to honor the glory of uh, major dhyan chand great hockey player of our country india and at the same time it is celebrated to acknowledge the importance of sports in our in the life of citizens of our country okay so as a, if we look into the life of major dhyan chand it's a big lesson to learn from as he began from a humble background background just he did a magic through his uh, hockey stick and he brought laurels for our country just for three consecutive years we won gold olympic gold just because of his uh, contribution and it was the aura of that great man it was his aura was so big at that particular time that one that hitler the germany hitler germany's uh, dictator hitler asked him to tell adopt the citizenship of germany so it was a big big personality and he, he remains he, this year the government of india has renamed our the khel rat award rajiv gandhi khel rat award has been renamed as a major dhyan chand dhyan chand khel rat award 
So, in sports, uh, India, since independence, India has taken leaps and bounds to excel in the field of sports. And just we, we come, we, no, no longer we can uh, our cricket define the sports of our country, nor it's a past glory of hockey. Now, now the whole scenario has changed. Many more athletes are uh, has t just turned around the sporting scene in our country. And the big example is that just concluded our Tokyo Olympics, where we have won seven seven uh, medals, okay, and one gold medal we have won, and just. Earlier we had uh, we were languishing in, in all the Olympics and it was the one concept one version was that nearly their version was we used to listen a lot we that nearly they, we were nearly missed the medal but this time in Tokyo Olympics we successfully fought our uh, this sport athlete Neeraj Chopra won the brought the gold for our country in the first time in a track and field competition so it was a great achievement. If we talk about the, our hockey team in the Olympics, men's hockey team has rebounded in this, uh, this year, this year in this uh, just concluded Olympics where they have given exemplary performance by winning a bronze after uh, 41 years. So it was it just they have washed away the pain and disappointment what we had for we were suffering for these 41 years. And at the same moment, we should not forget to mention about the, our women hockey team who were at the last place in Rio Olympics. But this time, they have fought, fought barrier, as a barrier, barrier and they have stood fourth in place in this uh, women hockey team. At the same time, when we are talking about our, this uh, Olympics 2020, we should also we should not forget to mention the Paralympics, which are parallelly parallelly going on along with this great event. The Paralympics are still going on, and uh, in this Paralympics, it's uh, it's it's, it's a just it's, it's simply a display of courage and determination. How how one a person with a strong determination can 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 kick out the pain and disbelief in his or her life and it, it is the best example that has been exemplified by this sports person as uh, two, uh, 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 this uh, person Harvinder Singh has, uh, he was the first man who has uh, brought gold medal in archery and second is the, uh, the that lady, the lady shooter who has uh, just grabbed two medals so and one uh, moreover I can also add that one bureaucrat from India, an IS officer has also joined this Paralympics, El Suhas, and he was just, uh, he was a district state of you know, Gautam Nagar in UP, and he has participated, and he is going, and his uh, medal, uh, medal expectations are very, uh, very strong, because he has, uh, he has qualified for the finals also, just now, and today only, we have drawn, uh, clinched to two medals in um, this uh, shooting competition again, uh, we have just been informed. So, uh, what uh, what I want to mention at the at last, eventually I want to say that sports has a great impact on a, each and everybody's life. So always give importance to sports. And our government of India, our government our union government, is also painlessly trying to bring the sports at the forefront. And they have launched. They, are, they had already launched this Khelo India program in 2018, and uh, now on Fit India program is going on. So, so sports is the major, major booster, can boost your uh, image, can boost your morale, can boost your image. So always take, at least take part in one sporting event. Thank you. Hi, Shikha. And I'm Prashikha Rakhita Sudhar, standing in front of you to talk about health and well-being. The very known two terms of, of you are the word health and fitness. Many times we tell or use the, the words whenever we say the phrases like health is wealth and fitness is the key. What does the word health really mean? It implies the idea of being well. A healthy and a fit person is the one who he or she can function well physically as well as mentally. Proper health and fitness do not depend on our own but also on our physical environment and the quality of food we intake. Health and fitness is more important aspect of our life. There is nothing more important than health for any human being. When we are healthy and fit, we are able to enjoy our life well. We can talk to our near and dear ones. We can laugh, we can smile, we can travel, we can enjoy food and sleep well. But when our health and fitness is not up to the mark, we are unable to do anything properly and stay behind. We cannot enjoy eating, 
watching sports or movies. Our mood always remains negative and we are unable to talk nicely with unknown and dear ones or even sleep properly. Our health and fitness is more valued than our wealth. In fact, our elders were always being focused on health and fitness part. They treasure it like wealth to maintain good health and fitness at its best all the times we need to take care of our hygiene and sanitation around us. We must eat a healthy and a complete diet. We must eat vegetables, milks, egg, etc. Everyone should make a diet chart and ensure that we, sh uh, we should take sufficient amount of carbohydrates, proteins, minerals and vitamins. Apart from eating, uh, we must maintain cleanliness in our rooms, house and surrounding areas. Well, there are many factors that are responsible for staggering health and fitness graph. But the major reason is the personal habit and living style of the people. A human body requires 20 grams of fat per day. The consumption of just a regular sized pizza adds up to 10 grams of fat to the human body. While a burger blesses you with 13 grams of fat and 100 grams of french fries promotes 15 grams of fat to your body. All the junk foods are destroying people's life and fitness these days. Due to fast paced life, fast paced life, people are concerned about uh, filling their stomach rather than considering what they are eating and its effect on their uh, its effect on their health and body. It's a great honor to celebrate online sports day in KV Takkola. <coughs> sports day in India is celebrated on 29th August every year in the memory of Major Gyan Chan's birthday <coughs> who participated in Olympics in 1928, 32 and 36. He was a hockey player, a renowned hockey player. Physical activities or exercises can improve your health and reduce the risk of developing serious diseases. Sports is also one activity not just for staying fit but the brain also. Staying physically active promotes oxygen flow which supports healthy brain development. COVID-19 pandemic has brought this fast moving world to a standstill. The fast moving world to a standstill. <clears throat> the impact is massive. Psychological issues, serious fitness issues, serious health issues and everyone is bothered about the health. <clears throat> In spite of this pandemic, the world has witnessed the Tokyo Olympics where 339 events were hosted. About 5,000 prizes were distributed for Olympics and Paralympic medals. <clears throat> it is strange that our country with such a great population of 139 crores stands 48th position winning only 7 medals in Olympics. And <clears throat> the developed nation like US have got 113, China 88 and Japan 58. 58. This is only for the Olympics and Paralympics also we have back medals. <coughs> but then you students can always be and participate actively in sports and regular training can take you to great heights and we will be in the new future getting more Olympic medals. WHO that is the World Health Organization today due to the COVID has a mantra be active champion this campaign aims to help you do that and to have some fun at the same time being active makes the body flexible fitness reduces the risk of depression declines the delay of cognitive onset of dementia 
you have to follow few steps so that we can be fit first one try exercise classes online second one dance to music with aerobics third one active games playing on the field fourth one try skipping rope skipping at home itself lastly do muscle strengthening and balance training these five activities if done daily on a daily basis each one of us can keep ourselves fit who recommends 30 minutes a day physical activities for the adults one hour for students why can't we do it and make ourselves fit very simple exercises which we can do is plant your feet firmly on the ground with knees over your heels lift your hips as much as you feel comfortable and slowly lower them again perform this exercise 10 to 15 times and rest for 30 to 60 seconds repeat up to 5 times a day this exercise will make you very active aerobics is also a part of exercise which is very easy to perform part of listening to music which is very effective way to keep ourselves and our physical strength it also gives us the psychological responses it makes us enhances the psychological responses in us these two things we can follow very easily by staying at home itself so my dear students i feel all of you can take care of your health very easily by staying at home and focusing on the game in which you are interested know the rules know the hard work which you need to do and you can excel in any game of your choice so i end my speech in saying that some people want it to happen some people wish it would happen others make it happen this is by michael jordan and i wish each one of us make it happen that is the activity that we take up every day to keep ourselves strong we make it happen good nutrition good health happy mind and body is is the need of the hour fitness is an activity which we need to imbibe in our day to day life thank you jai bharat
भर के खेलो खेलो इंडिया दुनिया को जीतो अपने हुनर को आज दिखला भी दो दिल से खेलो तुम्हें वो बात है हम सभी